Yo guys, this is a PS2 game running on my Android device. And no, this is not through any type of streaming or anything else like that. This is natively running on my Android device using an app called Daemon PS2 Pro. So since the last time we looked at PS2 emulators on the Android device, things have rapidly changed. And one of the newest and perhaps best PS2 emulators available right now for an Android device is this thing called Daemon PS2 Pro. Now, before we get to talking about the app, I, I do want to point out one big ethical concern, and this is the reason I did refund my purchase after finding out about this. There has been a whole lot of controversy about this developer stealing code, stealing open source code and using it within his app that he's selling for $10. Obviously, even being a developer myself, that doesn't sit well and it represents a lot of ethical concerns. So I was not really comfortable keeping the app, so I did refund it. I do understand not everyone cares about that. Some people just want a working PS2 emulator for your Android device, and this is definitely the fastest one. So I just want to make you aware of that and you know let you make your own decision with that. Now, with all that said, this is definitely the fastest PS2 emulator for your Android device. You know, I was able to run Sonic Heroes at a very playable 40 to 50 FPS. The controls are a little bit weird, but you know, this is a situation where you want really want to have a dedicated controller to play this, but this is the only emulator that is actually ran at a decent speed at, and it was very fun to play. Now I also tried one of my all-time classic favorites, Sly Cooper, and it did boot, which I was happy to see, um, but the speed wasn't that good. I only got 9 to 10 FPS, so definitely not very playable, and the audio lagged a whole lot behind the words, so there's still some improvement needed for that. Now if you do want an alternative, there is another app that I did cover two years ago called Play. Unfortunately, that one still not as far, that one is not at the same level as this one is. Uh, Sonic Heroes did not even run too well on the Play emulator, um, and I couldn't get Sly Cooper to boot. Nonetheless, it is still an open source alternative and a free one without ethical concerns, so definitely check out that one. So guys, this has been a quick look at the state of PS2 emulation on Android. At the end of the day, if you really want to play PS2 games, you're still stuck with a PC, but you know, maybe over time we'll get some decent options and see what really comes out. So guys, if you liked the video, definitely give it a thumbs up. Don't forget to go and hit that subscribe button. And as always, thanks for watching and stay tuned for another galvanizing video. Thanks.